Lighting circuit wiring diagrams for Jeep, Dodge and Chrysler vehicles are a common request to VACC's Tech Advisory Service. This is due to the many possible things that can cause these systems to fail. Once these diagrams are sent out, we regularly get another request asking for a description of operation, as these circuits are more complicated than the earlier systems. Lighting systems used to be relatively simple, with power via a fuse to a switch, which in turn might activate a relay, which would supply power to a light. Now many vehicles use data signals from a switch unit to a body control module, which supplies a pulse width modulated voltage or current to a light. This is how most Dodge, Jeep and Chrysler vehicles operate from 2008 onwards, making the wiring diagrams difficult to interpret. The light switches in these vehicles are mounted on the steering column and are called multifunction switches. However, the OE wiring diagrams do not show these switches as they are considered to be integrated into the steering column control module mounted behind the steering wheel. The steering column control module will monitor the switch position, then send a LIN bus signal to the instrument cluster. The instrument cluster will then read this signal and convert it into a CAN bus signal and send it to the totally integrated power module. The totally integrated power module acts as a body control module, which could send a pulse width modulated voltage to the selected circuit to turn the lights on or to make them flash. To efficiently diagnose and repair these types of lighting circuits, you will need an understanding of LIN bus and CAN bus systems, and a compatible diagnostic tool which can allow you to see if these signals are being sent and received by the various control units. Common issues that can impact these systems are the addition of aftermarket accessories which have been incorrectly attached to the wiring harness, which may damage the totally integrated power module. Or in other cases, water damage into the totally integrated power module can cause many strange electrical issues. For more information about interpreting the lighting circuit wiring diagrams on Jeep, Dodge and Chrysler vehicles from 2008 onwards, see the March 2022 issue of Tech Talk log on to VACC's Motortech or call VACC's Tech Advisory Service.